Welcome to the National Atomic Testing Museum, a historical and educational institution dedicated to telling the fascinating story of our nation's nuclear weapons testing program and how it has evolved over time. Hello, my name is Joel Ruby and I am the Undersecretary for Nuclear Security at the U.S. Department of Energy and the Administrator of the National Nuclear Security Administration, the federal agency responsible for designing and manufacturing U.S. nuclear weapons. NATM is one of only five museums in the U.S. that showcases how the NNSA enterprise of national laboratories, plants, and sites around the country applies its scientific and technical expertise to advance America's national security mission. During your tour, you will have the opportunity to see artifacts dating back as far as the Manhattan Project and read accounts of famous scientists and leaders who helped shape our modern day approach to nuclear deterrence. This museum is located 65 miles from NNSA's Nevada National Security Site, formerly known as the Nevada Test Site, and specifically focuses on the pivotal role the NNSS has played in the U.S. nuclear weapons testing program. Although the United States has not conducted nuclear explosives testing since 1992, the NNSS continues to play an important but different role in national security. NNSA is actively working with NATM to develop new exhibits that describe the current scientific work being done at the NNSS. This work continues our legacy to provide a safe, secure, reliable, and effective nuclear deterrent, and importantly, to also detect and deter the testing and use of nuclear weapons around the world. The exhibits you will see in the museum in the near future will tell the story of how the dedicated staff at the NNSS continue to work on critical nuclear security programs. Activities that will be highlighted will include conducting experiments that don't produce nuclear yield but gather detailed scientific understanding about how weapons behave. We are particularly interested in making sure we understand how weapons performance changes during decades in storage. We also use the NNSS to study the seismic response of explosions using conventional explosives that will help us better detect and analyze nuclear tests conducted by other countries. In addition, the NNSS is used to develop technologies that detect and locate dirty bombs, loose nukes, and other potentially dangerous radiological sources, and to train first responders to use specialized equipment to help protect communities across America. More than 250,000 people have been trained at NNSS since 1998. You can find out more about our upcoming exhibitions by visiting nationalatomictestingmuseum.org. I want to thank you for coming by today and I hope you enjoy your visit.